Friday night baseball from the Bay Area and the O.Co. Coliseum. Tonight we begin our road trip with the first of three between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Colorado. Jordan Zimmerman, the right-hander from the state of Wisconsin, is on the mound here. E.K., what's the word on him? Well, guys, you see the ERA there. Not anything that's going to jump out, but he has been dependable. He gives his ball club a chance to win. Yeah, a nice job there as this one gets right up the middle to start the ball game. Always nice to put a guy in the stretch right from the very start. Zimmerman comes set. First pitch on the way. Justin Upton is at the plate now, and he's quickly behind 0-1. EK, as we take a look at the Rockies' starting play here tonight, they've been mired in a team-wide slump of late, as with the loss last time out, they've now dropped eight of their last nine decisions. On to first, and they'll get the hustling Upton. It's a double play. Joey Votto will come on now, and no sooner did it look like they may have something started than the double play took it all away. And that's especially tough when you figure the part of the lineup they're in. These are the guys you want to have hitting with runners on base. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Grounded up the first baseline. But uh, this will get foul for strike two. Hit out towards second. Spangenberg is there. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Catfish Hunter is ready to go as he's on the mound for the Phils. Eric, any thoughts? Well, guys, you take a look right here. Right-handed hitters are hitting less than 250 against him. He's had his way with him. Delino DeShields stands in as he looks at ball one here. Bare hand pickup by A-Rod. Not in time. Oh, love the effort, though. That was a big-time stab. There was just too much speed getting down the line. Gene Segura is next as he finds himself behind 0-1. A little quick on that swing, and he finds himself behind 0-2. 0-2 count. Here's the pitch. Tried to get him to go after one below the knees, but it's 1-2. and two. Well, that's a good take there with two strikes. That wasn't an easy one to lay off of. Fastball swung on and missed for the first out. Miguel Cabrera will stand in now. Happy that this series is at home, no doubt, as you see his splits right there. But he's safe at first as he gets back in time. 0-1, here it comes. On its tailor made to short. Six, four, three. It's a double play, and the inning is over. We'll move to the second inning here in Oakland with no score. Alex Rodriguez will come Leading forward off, now. Off. Back in the lineup here Leading after getting yesterday season. afternoon off. Alex Rodriguez. Now he lifts a high pop-up. Drifting into foul territory on the right side. And a rather easy first out. Steve Pierce will stand in now as he was reinserted back into the lineup here after taking a needed day off yesterday. Chop foul right at home plate at strike one. Zimmerman gets the sign. 0-1 pitch on its way. Grounded to short. There's Segura. Throw on to first. Two gone. Batting six. So bases are empty here with two gone. And in steps the dangerous Ichiro. Behind on that one. Now behind in the count. 0-1. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. Swing and a little tapper. That goes foul. Two strikes on him now. No score here as we play inning number two. Drilled on the ground is short. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Al Kaline will get his first shot here, and you can see he's got that average up near the 330 mark to begin play. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. Just a bit late, and he's fallen behind 0-2. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. But a foul ball, and the count holds at 0-2. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. Out in front of that one, but he stays alive and will do it again on 0-2. Oh, 
Protecting on 0 2, so we'll do it again. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Stepping in, Tom Noonan, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. That evens it up one and one. That's lifted the other way out to left. Upton moves over. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Salvador Perez will dig in. Currently fifth in the National League in batting to begin play. In tight with the curveball. Backed up on him a little there, and it's ball one. There you see the league leaders in hitting we touched on a moment ago. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. Josh Hamilton will stand in, and as you can see, his home and road splits there. He's been a much better hitter away from home. And that's cut on and missed 0 and 1. And a swing and a miss as they jump ahead of Hamilton here. Nothing in two. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Rocky Strand 1. Patrick Rosales will stand in now. And as you can see, he enters play with 16 home runs on the season so far. Starts him with a good rising fastball there for strike one. Barely able to make contact. Down 0 and 2 now. Zimmerman's ready. 0 2 pitch on its way. And he'll try and tempt him with one in the dirt, but he'll hold back here. It's 1 and 2. Yeah, you could tell right there. 0 and 2, he's just thinking about protecting the plate. And he nearly chased a bad one there. But he caught himself at the last possible instant. Chop foul at the plate, and the count holds it 2 and 2. Here's the pitch on 2 and 2. Hit in the air out toward left. Hamilton is camped under this one and he's got it for the first out. Batting eight. Center fielder Striding into nine. the box. Eduardo Nunez. Nunez. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Oh, he looks like he's swinging a garden hose out there as this is cut on and missed for strike one. And for as bad as he missed that pitch, you can bet we're going to see that again before this at bat's over. Chop foul right at home plate. Here it comes on nothing and two. Weak chopper up the line. Played on the backhand. In time to first, and there are two away. Chris Bryant will stand in now with two away, trying to avoid another one, two, three inning. Now, this has been total domination these past few innings. They haven't been able to mount any kind of threat whatsoever. Third inning, no score to this point. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. I tell you, he's got a good pace, a good tempo to him out there right now. Liner towards second. But right there is the second baseman, and that will retire the side. So they go quietly here in this. Ruben Tejada steps in, hoping to get things going at the plate. You can see it's been a bit of a struggle for him in recent games. And he'll try to crowd him there to start the at-bat. It's 1-0. and oh. Swing and a miss, 1-1. One and one. Hit hard on the ground to second. And Robinson will throw him out. One gone. Corey Spangenberg will get his first opportunity here. And that average is certainly not where he wants it. Down in the 220s to begin the ball game. Here's the 0-1. That's taken. Now it's 0-2. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Bottom of inning number three, nothing, nothing, our score. And another foul ball. The next 0-2 misses, and that'll move it to one and two now. All right, so he sort of wasted one up right there. Now I think we'll see a breaking ball down in the zone, trying to get him to swing and miss. The batter, center fielder. 
Delino. Delino to Shields. Will stand in for the second time now as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing and one. And it's quickly 0-2. Bases are empty here with two men out. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Upton on the move. And that ends the inning. So it's back to the top of the order now. And in steps a man whose number 42 has been forever retired, Jackie Robinson. Right back to him, and it's off his shoe. But he is able to recover as he gets the out at first. One away now. The left fielder, number eight. Leadoff man gone Justin for the left fielder, Upton. Justin Upton. Zimmerman steps into the windup. Here's the first pitch. And that's by him. It's 0-1. 0-1 again, and he's at 100% on first pitch strikes. Now in the middle innings of this one. No wonder he's pitched so well. Hit high and deep to straightaway right field. K-line ranging back. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. The first baseman, Joey Votto stands Joey in. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out. Sends that one out of play for strike one. And nope. Votto's able to lay off that one as the count one turns one. even to one and one. And if he can get himself into a fastball count, don't be surprised if he has a nope. big cut That's or something. Ball. Maybe try and break this tie ball game. Bat explodes as this has popped up. And he'll avoid the fragments out there to make the catch that... Gene Segura is set to lead us off in the home Leading half the of the fourth, fourth inning. inning. Well, they still don't have any runs on the board yet, so getting this leadoff man on base would be huge. Now a swing and a fly ball. But no chance to run it down. It's a foul ball. Again, he sends it out of play. Trying to strike him out for the second time. That misses, says the home plate umpire. One and two. Where it misses, I'm not quite sure. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. And this is taken in by Upton for the first out. The first so one away, and that'll bring in Miguel Cabrera. Cabrera. Hey. Drops in a strike to start the at-bat. Nothing in one. Well, he's thrown a first pitch strike to about 60% of the batters he's faced. So that's a pretty good percentage because we're into the middle innings right now. Pitching has the upper hand early as we're scoreless in inning number four. On the ground to third. Rodriguez scoops it up. Throw on to first. He'll take care of Cabrera for the second out. In now. Now Kaline. He'll look to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Took a little off and it's in for a called strike one. And here's a ball hit in the air. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Alex Rodriguez, the third baseman, heads for the box to start off the fifth in this one. Well, they still aren't even on the board yet, so this leadoff guy needs to get on so they can manufacture a run. High and tight here to begin the inning. It's ball one. Line toward right center. Solid base hit for him, his first of the afternoon. Around first, heading for second now. Oh, you better have to pay attention to this guy right now. He is heating it up. Seven straight games now with that hit. Digging in to try it again, Steve Pierce. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. And not the greatest of starts to the at-bat as he reaches for one out of the zone for strike one. Yeah, he really pulled off of that one, and that's not the kind of swing we're accustomed to seeing from a guy like him. Right, especially starting off an at-bat. Hit the other way out toward right field. K-line is there, one away. So a runner on second with one down now, and in steps the dangerous Ichiro. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Chop foul at the plate. Strike one. Here's the 0-1 pitch. 
Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0-2. Chop foul at the plate, and he stays alive, still 0-2. Here comes the nothing and two pitch. High in the air out to center field. DeShields over to his left, and that's the second out of the inning. At the plate, Patrick Rosales. As the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. This is where he's so comfortable hitting righties so far this year really well, hitting over 300 on the year. And he waves at a curveball there. No balls in a strike. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. Tejada is there to make the catch and the side is retired. Tom Noonan comes to the plate as we get started here in the bottom of the fifth. Absolutely nothing going on in this game so far. So we'll see if the leadoff man can get something going. Hey! And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. Now a left-hander up and throwing in that Philly bullpen. But right to A-Rod as he spears it for the first down. The catcher, number 13. Now to the plate, Salvador Perez. He singled his last time up. First pitch is a slider down low. It's 1-0. Swung on and missed, one, ball, one and one. Strike. Salvador Perez is a multiple gold glove winner behind the plate, including in 2015, but he can definitely do some damage with the bat as well. Both teams with just two hits apiece thus far. A little late on the fastball, but he's able to spoil that one off, and he'll get another chance. Yeah, Perez is just a fantastic all-around player, and you know he was the first catcher since 1992 to be named World Series MVP. Well, Matt, he's what we call TP. Total package. Josh Hamilton is into the box. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one, and it's strike one. And he falls behind 0-2. No runs, three hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Rockies thus far. To second for one. Back to first, and a great stretch there may be the difference. It's a... Eduardo Nunez makes his way to the box to lead us off in the sixth inning. Zimmerman looks in. Here's the first pitch. I had him lunging at that one out of the zone, and that's strike one. Not too many strikeouts on the ledger for him so far, but it hasn't really mattered. Yeah, I think ideally you'd like to see him miss a few more bats, but as long as you're keeping guys off balance and you're letting your defense help you, you don't need to strike a ton of guys out to be successful. Lifted in the air out to right. K-line is there. He's got it one away. The catcher number Chris 17. Bryant stands in for Chris the second time. Bryant. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, he was pretty unlucky last time because he squared up that oh, fastball one. nicely. So we're going to have to see if they still come at it with hard stuff. Ah, not able to hold on there as he swings through a pitch in the dirt and it doesn't look good for him now. Down 0-2. And it looks like the scouting report says, work this guy away, and, and it's been paying off. Right, and whoever put together that scouting report did a real nice job because this whole team hasn't done much offensively at all. And this is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. Now batting, second baseman. Jackie Robinson Jackie will dig Robinson. in here. One for two. He's singled and grounded out so far. Now a half swing here as he wanted to pull it back, but he does so too late. It's strike one. And this one's hit on the ground, but foul. No runs, two hits, and no errors on the ledger for the Phillies to this point. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Ruben Tejada will lead things off for Colorado as they look to get something started in their half of the sixth. Lifted in the air out to left field. Upton's after it. One out. Corey Spangenberg comes to the plate looking to put the ball in play. He went down on strikes last time. 
And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. It appears safe to say now that that man right there has turned things around from his last start. And it's a great sign, too, of exactly what you need to do. You have to have a short memory out there. But you're right. He's pitching with a lot more confidence in this outing. And he'll try and one tempt ball. him with one in the two dirt, strikes. but he'll hold back here. It's one and two. To short. Fielded by Pierce. Throw gets him. Two down. Center fielder. Ready for three. another chance. Delano, Delano DeShields. DeShields. He flew out in his last at bat. Watches a fastball right there for strike one. And that's inside off the plate with the fastball. It's one and one. Here's a looping fly ball out to right. Rosales is there, and he'll put it away to retire the side. One, two. Justin Upton will come forward now to begin the seventh inning in what's been a very briskly played ball game here tonight. And that's what happens when you get two starters that are on top of their game. It's been great pitching, great defense, not a lot of base runners, and a very even game through six innings. Now a right-hander has started to get loose in the Colorado bullpen. Now this pitch sails up and in, and that leaves him muttering to himself. It's ball two. Late swing on the hitter's count. Still a good count for him now, however, at two and one. And Upton lays off again, and he's in control of the count. It's three and one. Oh, I think you'd be real happy with a leadoff walk. Something just to get things started against this guy. Fastball is taken for a strike, and he runs it full three and two. And a good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. Joey Votto will get his third shot at it here. He's bounced out and popped out in his previous two trips. Well, on the bright side, I guess, he is putting the ball in play. He's just not getting that solid contact that you're looking for when a guy's really seeing the ball well. Hard hit ball to second. Oh, look at Spangenberg. It's there. He got him. Wow. Made it look easy. So a tour gone now in the Philadelphia seventh, and that'll bring the dangerous Alex Rodriguez to the plate. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Around first on his way to second now. And your go-ahead run is in there at second base as he's got himself a two-out double. Steve Pierce will step in now as his guys look for a breakthrough here with a runner in scoring position. Yeah, and it's been a long time coming. They haven't done anything with their opportunities so far. Maybe this will be the time that they finally crack the scoreboard. Ichiro Suzuki gets a shot now with two men on and two away here in inning number seven. Hoping to keep it tied, here it comes. Hit in the air out to left field. Hamilton is under it, and that retires the side. Gene Segura will stand in now. He struck out and flied out 0 for 2 thus far. Swing and a looper to left. And there's your go-ahead base runner right away as this is down for extra bases. And your go-ahead run is in at second base here with a leadoff double. Catfish comes set. Here comes the first pitch. Miguel Cabrera is the batter now as he looks at a ball 1-0. That'll be a souvenir, and the count will move to one and one. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Gets on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. And this is swung on and missed, and boy, they took care of a key man there. One away. The right fielder, number six. Out in front of it, strike one. And he lays off for ball one. Ooh, you might have felt the squeeze on that one. That might just change the whole complexion of the at-bat. A dive, but he can't get it. It's through into the outfield. But it is not in time as they take the lead here in the late going. Tom Noonan steps in with one in, one out, and one on here in the inning. Aaron Loop will get the call now as he'll try to get the final two outs and send this one along into the eighth. 
Tom Noonan is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself down a strike. It's 0-1. High in the air and deep to straightaway left. Upton going back. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Salvador Perez will step in now. He's singled twice to this point. And a ball 1-0. Drilled right back up the middle. That's through another base hit for him. He's three for three. Josh Hamilton will stand in looking to turn things around. He struck out and bounced into a double play so far. Not such a hot start. Sinker to open the A-B in there for strike one. Sinker, and this one's over as well. Nothing in two now. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. And the recovery is too late as he's able to beat the throw to first. Now Ruben Tejada will step in now. He's bounced out and flown out in his first two plate appearances. Bases are loaded here, two down. And it's grounded foul. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this will wind up being a foul ball. Back up the middle. That will get through into center field. A base hit. And he is in there. And he can't hang on to the ball here at home plate. And as a result, the run is in to score. Corey Spangenberg will step in now with three home in the inning and another two men out there on base. This inning's really starting to unravel quickly from a defensive point of view. This is where you need a nice pop-up in a big way. Hit hard on the ground towards second. He's got it. Throw on to first, and an important pitch there is they. Leading off the inning, Patrick Rosales, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Mm, a little tardy there. No balls and a strike. Well, the guy you see right there has been terrific. But will they let him work these final two innings? Well, I think the pitch count is in his favor. Everybody pays a lot of attention to that. So barring a huge spike right here in the eighth, I don't see any reason why he can't get these final six That's outs. That misses one, one and two. two. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. Eduardo Nunez stands into the box. He's 0 for 2 so far in this one. Chopped weakly to the left. Throw won't be in time as he reaches it first. The catcher, number seven. Chris Bryant will stand in again. He lined out his first time around and then was a strikeout victim last time up. Yeah, we'll see if he can get back to the swing he put on the ball in his first at bat. He got himself a nice solid line drive that just didn't fall. And goodbye. This one ain't coming back. So it's a two-run shot to right center. Eighth home run on the season for him. And the Phils have cut it to a 3-2 to two game now. Ah, not the greatest at-bat thus far as he misses that pitch in the dirt and falls behind nothing in two now. Do you even bother with anything else here? No, I sure wouldn't. As a hitter, you're thinking, look for fastball, adjust for an off-speed pitch. And so far in this at-bat, he hasn't made any adjustments. Got him swinging in the dirt. Perez corrals it, and he He's makes out. the throw to first. Robinson is retired, two down now. Hello. Justin Upton will stand in for the Justin fourth time now, Upton. still looking for his first hit of the ball game. And he's not the only one either. This has been a great pitching performance so far, and they've had these guys chasing their tails all game long. Here comes the 0-1. On the ground, up the middle. And that gets through, so he'll have his first base hit, make him one for four in the game now. The now you see the Colorado skipper up out of the dugout on his way to the mound. And he's looking to the bullpen here, so it would appear that's all for his starter tonight. Yimmy Garcia will take over here with the runner at first, and two gone in the inning. Joey Votto swings and misses there, so he's down 0-1. Now you've got the tying run over at first, two away. 
He's going to be looking to try and find a gap right here and bring that guy all the way around to score. And not too shabby out of the pen. Takes just two pitches to get the ground ball, and that ends. Delino DeShields will stand in. He flew out his last time up. And that's just not really his game. Anytime he keeps it on the ground, he's got a pretty good chance of beating out a hit. Checked his swing there and pops this one up. Oh, and he can't reel it in out there. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Line drive to left. And that'll get by and on through towards the wall. Around first, digging for two now. Around second, he'll try for third. And the Rockies kick it into high gear to open the inning. It's a leadoff triple. Shortstop, Gene Segura. Gene Segura stands in as he looks at a called strike. And this ball's heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0-2 now. Grounded to third. Oh, and this goes right past him. And they'll extend their lead even further as the runs in to score from third. It's 4-2. The first baseman, number 24. Miguel. It's swung on and hit in the air. Nunez is in pursuit, but he won't get there. It falls in. The throw into second. Here's Segura around third, heading for the plate. And the run will score all the way from first. It's 5-2. Al Kaline steps in after hitting an RBI single his last time around. That's in there. Base hit. And they'll get it in quickly. It's first and third now with nobody out. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Tom Noonan is in now as he watches a pitch for ball one. Would you say he's not really finishing his pitches at this point? That's a good way to put it. It looks like he's aiming a little too much, and that's not working for him. Has to be thinking strikeout here. Oh, here's a line drive into center field. It's a base hit. Into score is the runner from third, and that will stretch the lead to four now. Digging in and looking for more, Salvador Perez. He's looking to go four for four with a base hit right here. In there at the knees, strike one. Now a ball lined to the left side. Swing and a ball chopped foul right at home plate. Chopped at the plate, but that one rolls foul. Another foul ball, and this battle will continue. He's ready. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Boy, tough to lay off, but he's glad he did. It's 1-2 and two now. Still now on 1-2, and two, you don't have to make the perfect pitch out there. The count is still well in your favor on the mound. Josh Hamilton will stand in. One of the few guys not to join the hit parade so far. Drops in a strike to start the at-bat. Nothing in one. Swing and a line drive. A swing and he pops him up on the infield. And the infield fly rule will be in effect here. Ruben Tejada stands in. The eighth man to bat in the inning as he'll get a shot now with two on and two out. Now a slider, and he gets ahead of him here 0-1. Lifted into center field. Nunez has a read on it. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. A look there at the Bay Bridge from the East Bay side, where we are for this one from the O.Co. Coliseum in Oakland. Striding in to start the ninth, Alex Rodriguez. And they'll need him to get something going here. He's set. Here it comes. And we kick off the ninth inning with a swinging strike here. Nothing in one. Look out as this bat shatters on impact. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. Steve Pierce will stand in, needing to do something here to get on base as they're down to their final two outs. Yeah, and you just can't worry about the score right here. You just got to be able to string together a couple of base runners and take it one pitch at a time, one runner at a time. Head down through first. He's heading for two. And he's in there safely. He's got a double. Ichiro Suzuki will stand in. He flew out his last time up. Ichiro Suzuki. Tap fouls at home plate. He's 
set. Here's the 0 1. Slider taken here. One ball, one strike. He can't worry at all about that runner at second. I mean, his run means nothing. Just go right at the guy at the plate. Pulled toward right center field. On the move is DeShields. He makes the catch, and the runner from second will tag and hit for third. The relay throw, and he's safe. Patrick Rosales makes his way to the plate, needing to make something happen. They're down to their final out in the ninth inning. Yeah, it's not looking too good for him anymore, but you know what? There's no clock in this sport, and that's for good reason. You've got to fight for all 27 outs. Donnie couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane to the plate, and that'll be ruled a strike. And he gets strike three called to end it here, and with that, this one is over.